There are eight quarterbacks left in the NFL playoffs, and I'm going to be ranking them eight through one based off of this season. Let's start at number eight, Baker Mayfield. He's had a really good season. It should be the top candidate for comeback player of the year. Let's go to number seven, Jordan Love. He's playing like a Pro Bowl quarterback, calm demeanor, throwing from different arm angles, and he's playing like he can be any team right now. Number six, Jared Goff has led Detroit out of the dark ages, right? First playoff victory in 30 years. Number five. Brock Babyface Purdy has proven he can elevate Kyle Shanahan's system, was the front runner for most of the season in the MVP race, and now has the Niners as the number one seed on the NFC side. Number four, Josh Allen. I mean, talent has never been the issue. It's all about him taking care of the football. Now the question is, can he exercise those demons and get past the Chiefs this week? Number three, Patrick Mahomes. I know he struggled in the beginning of the year, but the offense has looked significantly better the last few weeks. Number two, might surprise some people, C.J. Stroud. That's right, I said it, C.J. Stroud. The best touchdown to interception ratio in the NFL. Led the NFL in pass yards per game, playing cool, calm demeanor in the pocket, knowing exactly where to go with the football. And right now, it's probably playing with the most confidence out of all these quarterbacks in the playoffs. And at the number one spot, Lamar Action Jackson will probably be this year's MVP, the most dynamic player in the NFL. I believe he and Todd Munkin have worked together so well in taking this offense to another level. Lamar Jackson's my number one guy in regards to quarterbacks left in the playoffs.